Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video I'd like to talk about the history of the microscope. During the 1590s, two Dutch spectacle makers, Hans and Zacharias Janssen, began experimenting. They would put several lenses in a tube and made a very important discovery. The object near the end of the tube appeared to be greatly enlarged, much larger than just using a magnifying glass. In the 1660s, Robert Hooke used this crude microscope and began looking at all kinds of objects. He put all of his drawings in a book called Micrographia. He is also credited with naming cells and also studied fleas and other objects under his microscope. In the 1670s, Anton von Leeuwenhoek was a grinding and polishing lens person. He was considered the best person around. These lenses led to him building a microscope, which was considered the first practical microscope. In 1674, Anton von Leeuwenhoek was the first to see and describe bacteria. Since this time, microscopes have gotten better. Compound microscopes have advanced from multiplying times three to multiplying 400 times. But another huge advance in microscopes didn't occur until German physicist Ernest Ruska and electrical engineer Max Knoll constructed an electron microscope in 1931. The electron microscope uses accelerated electrons in order to view objects. Modern electron microscopes can magnify up to 10 million times. There's a brief history of the microscope. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and share.